I got some stuff ooh, from Ikea yesterday. I got this shelf unit. It's called Bag Bagabold. It was only $25, so I'm going to set this up. I'm going to put it next to my TV. I also got this white stuff because, okay, you know how everyone has pampas grass? I wanted, okay, it's pretty tall too. It's t taller than the TV, which is what I wanted. I wanted something like pampas grass, but I didn't want pampas grass. It's too like boho. My style is more like minimalistic, modern. Why oh, am I out of breath, guys? I'm literally always out of breath. Anyway, so I got that instead. And then I want to go to H&M Home to get some really nice... Oh, Y'all, pray for me. To get some really nice ceramic vases to put that in. I'm so excited. I'm so Oh, excited i love redecorate i'm just really excited i sold the chairs that i used to have here um so i could get space for a couch i also moved my vanity over there so you guys can see it's a white vanity i have some like candles and stuff i'm gonna get some coffee books probably put either a mirror or some wall art above i'm just so excited we're going to put this little display thingy up it should be higher than the couch. I'm so glad that it's not like a stark white. It's a nice like off-white color, which is perfect. So I'm gonna put this together, show you guys what it looks like. And then let me show you guys the little pieces that I got from Ikea. All right, so these are the few things that I got yesterday. I'm definitely gonna need more. But I got this really, really nice plate. Um, you can use this to put jewelry, your keys, literally anything. So I'm going to put this in the unit and I'll probably put, I don't know yet what I'm going to put inside or what I'm going to put on here. I will figure that out, but it's a really, really nice color. I love this color so much. It's really pretty, actually. It's matte. I like how it's matte on the side and then it's shiny at the top. Absolutely beautiful. Then I got these two candle holders. These are all from Ikea. Um, and then I want to get black candles, black candlesticks. Then I got a little black vase thing. Not going to put any plants in here. I'm just going to put it in the unit. And then I got this little timer, whatever it's called. Y'all know what these things are. Hourglass timer thing. Um, but it has a nice like beige sand in there. This is really, really pretty. So I'm going to put this in the unit as well. And you can kind of see, like, my color scheme is very, like, neutral. <sighs> Love it. I'm so excited. So, so excited. I also made this random piece of art yesterday. Didn't really come out well, but this is what it looks like. Actually, no, it doesn't look too bad. I just took a bunch of paint and poured it on the thing and then let it drip down. This is what it looks like. The texture came out kind of weird because it's really thick. I feel like I didn't do it properly. But I might also put this in the... I feel like it's going to work. You guys see the vision? I'm going to put this in the display case too. And I feel like it kind of matches all the colors that I have going on. So maybe I'll make more of these. They're really easy.
description box not gonna try it on but if you follow me on instagram if you don't i'll put it on the screen it's and all my social medias they're always in the description box um i've done i've showed some of these pieces in my tiktok a little try on haul the pieces that i got from asos i've taken some pictures in them so check out my instagram and tiktok if you want to see them like on me um, but for this video, I'll just show you guys and all the links will be in the description box. So first piece I got is this mini skirt from ASOS. This is a mini skirt. Like, she is mini, but it's really cute. I love the bottom. It also does have a slit, like over here. But I really like this. I already styled this in an outfit on my Instagram. Um, and I love the way that I styled it. I'm also going to a concert with my cousin in... September. I'm so excited and I feel like I'm probably gonna wear this. I feel like this would be a really cute concert piece and I have a pair of shoes from Naked Wolf that I really 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 want so hopefully by September I get them and I feel like they will look so cute with this so I love this. And then I got another skirt. This one is from H&M. <sighs> Already out of breath guys. <laughs> It's from H&M. I've taken pictures in this. I've made Instagram reels and TikToks. So again, follow my other social media if you want to see them on. But this is an orange maxi skirt. I love this color. I did not know that I was an orange girl, but I feel like it complements my skin tone like so nicely. Like I love this color. I love this skirt. And I love how I can wear it low waisted. Like looks so good i'll insert some pictures actually and then i got this really cute top from h m it has like a corset bottom then at the back it's kind of like scrunched up and at the back it like ends like it's like cropped at the back and it's longer in the front and it also like comes down in the middle so it makes your waist look really really small i love this i haven't worn this out yet I showed it in like my TikTok try on haul, but I haven't like worn it out. So I'm excited to style this piece, but I got this from H&M. And then I got a sweater. Now don't ask why I got a sweater when it's literally June, uh, but I love this sweater so much. It's from Collusion. I got it off of ASOS. I love the contrast. I love the colors and this is so comfortable. I actually wore this to church on Sunday because it was cloudy and honestly it was really really windy so i'm glad that i wore this but i love the color like i love this so much it's so comfortable and i feel like this is perfect for like summer nights when because i love going to the beach um like in the evening nighttime in the summer it's the best to just like watch the sunset and you know sometimes in the night it gets a little bit chilly I feel like this is perfect to throw on top of like some like loose black jeans or even like a pair of like biker shorts in the summer evening time. Just a cute little warm comfortable piece you can wear in the evening and in the fall time. I can't wait to style this for fall but I love this so much. I feel like I've been eyeing this for a while which is why I just decided to get it now. Love this. Um, then I also got... Oh, sorry, y'all. I also got this bag from H&M, too. Just a cute little shoulder bag. I like it. I like the color. I need to get more bags. I realize I really don't have a lot. And I like bags like this that are just very simple, nothing too complicated. But I'm realizing, like, accessories add a lot to your outfit, and I feel like I never used to accessorize, so I need to get some more. I also got this from H&M. I like this. The only thing is, like, it rides up at the bottom, and then it, like goes into the bottom of my bra which i don't like um and also because of the shape it's like you have to really like tuck your bra straps in but they don't stay so i feel like this is the kind of crop top that like you couldn't wear a bra underneath so if you're not comfortable with that i wouldn't recommend it but i like it i also got this in blue but the blue one's in the laundry right now i'm trying like a more neutral aesthetic for my instagram i feel like it already is but i'm trying to make it more neutral and i also want like more diverse photos so i want some like at home chill aesthetic photos because i like lifestyle content so i feel like i need to post more lifestyle content on my instagram so that's what i'm trying to do today so just be sitting on here y'all anyways 
<sighs> I get so tired so easily. But I blame it on my low iron. And I also blame that on me not taking my iron pills for a long time. Um, but obviously I'm going to set up my lights here. And then just take some like chill pictures on the couch. I'm going to change my outfit probably to like something that's like all neutral. Like white beige to kind of go with the couch. And then I might take like other pictures on the couch too, but like maybe with like the neon orange skirt. So it's like a contrast. So I'll have like multiple different pictures on the couch with different poses in different outfits. Uh, don't know how much of that I'm going to be vlogging because I'm going to use my phone to take pictures. But any pictures that I take, I will insert them or they might be like the thumbnail of this video. That's what we're going to do. So I guess doing my makeup didn't go to waste. Hopefully the pictures come out nice. If they don't, this is all fine. We'll take pictures another day. But let's see. Hopefully the pictures come out nicely. Guys, I dyed my hair. And like, let me go close to the light. My roots are already growing out. Do you guys see that? Like my roots are actually already growing. I don't know how my... Oh, also, I got the Huda Beauty banana bread under eye powder i feel like it's looking really good that's what the girlies on tiktok that's what they be talking about so that's what i got see i feel like if i use these lights to take pictures on the couch just some chill pictures i think it'll look really good so time to change and take some pictures reels i also want to film a tiktok vlog so i need to make sure i have enough foot. this was me the whole video that i was just filming the number of times i was like messing up on my words but we not gonna give up we not gonna give up we not gonna give up are we no we're not okay i don't know why i have so much energy today really i should be tired because the way that i was falling asleep at the end of my work not actually falling asleep let me not say that but I was kind of falling asleep by the end of my work day. So the fact that all of a sudden I'm just like. Anyways, guys, let's film some videos for TikTok and Instagram. I also want to film a little TikTok mini vlog. All of that content is filmed on my phone. So I don't know how I'm going to show you guys all of that. Maybe I'll like vlog with my camera, but then I need my tripod. So we're going to get our outfits together. And I'll show you guys my little setup for filming. I think what I'm going to do is usually the lighting over here for my TikTok videos is better. I know right now you can't you can't see the vision, but if you see my TikTok videos and you see me film over here, you know what I'm talking about. But the other day I took pics in this corner. I just took away my TV. I took away all this stuff and I took pictures here. The only thing about doing that is the lighting over there will be my artificial lights, which are very cool toned, whereas the lights over here are more warm toned. So like I use my lights and these lights and it makes it warm and I feel like it's more complementary to my skin tone. So I'm gonna see, because I also was gonna, child, we gonna film that video another day. The pose videos, we're gonna do that another day. Maybe tomorrow, because I have time tomorrow too. But I do really want to film some TikToks today. And uh, I filmed an Instagram reel the other day. It came out cute, but I kind of want to film it in that corner instead. So that's what we're going to try and do Um, pretty much for that video. Hopefully that video is up before this. If it is, I will link it in the description box or something. But I was going to do monochromatic outfits. So I was going to do the orange on orange. The black on black. And then the white on white.
three different like spring monochromatic outfits simple easy so i'm gonna set up the corner for that i'm gonna be charging my phone so i'm not gonna be vlogging myself setting it up but i'll show you guys what it looks like when it's done and then we're gonna get to editing tonight and then hopefully all this content will be good i'm gonna play some music i'm going to get in the mood because for these fashion videos girl like you need to look confident you need to look like you know what you're doing even if you don't like with these fashion videos like you need to you know so i'm gonna play some music get myself even more hype than i already am and i've just been feeling good guys like i genuinely love content so much because Woo, I can't wait until, well, first of all, I can't wait until I finish school so that I could work as an interior designer because I'm really about to take over the whole interior design world, you know? But I also can't wait until, like, I'm at the point where I'm making full-time income off of content because the way that making content literally gives me energy, like, the way that my job drains me, why was I literally almost falling asleep at the end of my workday? When I, like, it's not even, it's not even, it's not a physically demanding job. I was just falling asleep. But I filmed one video and all of a sudden I just have energy because I just love, I just love this. I love doing this. I love giving you guys advice. Like, I love filming. I'm excited to edit. I just love it so much. I really do, like. <laughs> I need it too, I need it too